You're on Rescue TV with the Divine Miranda Kerr and we're renaming Rescue TV Miranda TV. I like it. Do you like I it? I do. Thank Welcome you. Welcome back. Thank you. And now we're talking about the second most searched thing about you. You know, the first most searched thing is your figure and oh, your okay. health regime. And the second most searched thing is your hair. Oh, I didn't know that. Yes. Miranda Kerr hair. How to get Miranda Kerr hair. Victoria's Secret Miranda Kerr hair. Yeah, good. <laughs> nice. So, spill. Spill the beans. You're the new ambassador for Clear Shampoo. I am, yes. I've been using the products for the last few months. Well, actually, when they approached me, I said I'd love to try the products, and I tried them for a good month, and I really noticed a difference with my hair. You have beautiful hair. Yeah. And I guess the challenge for you is living in all the different countries and traveling so much to keep your hair beautiful and your scalp comfortable. Yeah, for me it's about putting the nutrients into the scalp and that's what I love about these products. Well, you are trained in nutrition and yeah. that was one of the things I was going to say. Is that one of the things that appealed to you about the range? Well, for me, I couldn't find an, like a certified organic range of shampoo and conditioners and whatnot that I was personally happy with and happy with the results and in the industry that we're in my hair does have to look good and I do need products that work and so when I tried these products I really loved the results that I was getting and so I thought why not why not endorse something that I actually you know I'm really loving. That's fantastic and one of the things I wanted to ask you is um, you know you have long hair which is quite classic but you seem to kind of evolve the look is your hair a little bit shorter than when you were doing David Jones? Have you yes, trimmed it a little? Yes, yes. So how often would you say cut your hair and colour your hair? Well, I like to have the regular trim. It also makes me, makes me feel like a little fresher to have a little it trim. It does look more fresh, yeah. Yeah, I feel like it energetically, like, you know, cutting yeah. your hair, you feel fresh and new. And yeah, I have a little trim and I do a hair treatment once a week. The Clear has a nice treatment that you can put in at home. And do you like take any also, supplements for well, health, hair or health? I mean, I do take, um, for me, I like to get as much as I can from the food that I'm eating. That's right, that's what I was going to say. Yeah, so, so do you change I your diet? I have avocado pretty much almost every day. I have almonds and um, sunflower seeds and macadamia nuts and, you know, those yummy things and fish. Um, and I even, like, I use a lot of olive oil in my salads coconut oil to cook with. And that's all great for hair as that's well. That's all really good for your hair, yeah. I, I remember so internally in as well as externally. And also the thing about um, me is that I like to, like, you be as healthy as you can and you, and you know, you use organic products when and where you can, but sometimes you need to have a balance and it's about having that balance. I do, as I said to you before, the 80-20 rule. So it's like 80% healthy and organic and 20% indulgent. And I would have to say that this falls into a bit of the indulgent category, um, for, category you. for me. And I'm in, indulging in a product that really works for me. And let me ask you something. How does Orlando like your hair? Does he like it up or down or long he, or short? He actually likes it up. Does he? Mm, just simply back off my face. And um, what? But my dad likes my hair down. Yeah. <laughs> How do you like your hair? Oh, up or down? I don't mind. You don't mind? It is. It is nice though to have it. If I'm with Flynn and whatnot at home, I like to have it off my face. The mother style. Yeah, just up a top knot or off the face. Exactly. <laughs> it's like then I just don't need to worry about it as much. But it's nice for work to have it out. So this is a long time you've been in Australia. Yeah, this it stint. Is. Yeah. Um, what have you been doing? What did you do for Father's Day? Oh, we had a wonderful Father's Day with um, my dad, Orlando and Flynn and we had a beautiful lunch together and we played in the park for a little bit and then after that um, I rented a car and we were like, because Orlando has this thing for Mustangs, he likes the oh. old Mustangs, so we rented an old Mustang. Wow, here in Sydney? Yeah, it's a beautiful, um, it's a beautiful yellow, almost like this beautiful yellow on my dress, the colour of the car. Wow, and yeah. did, did you scoot around Must Sydney? Must have been 1950s, yeah. Scooted around. Had the did you get spotted? Watching the sunset, really. Did you get spotted? Uh, just right at the end. Right at the end. Yeah. They didn't get to take yeah. the day away from you. No, thank goodness. So... And then we had a nice dinner. Are you back? You're going back to the States? No, I'm going to spend time with Orlando because he's going to be filming. Okay. I will take a bit of time off. That's fantastic. You have yeah. been so busy. I have. I'm looking forward to having like, that time off with Orlando and Flynn and... Yeah. So um, you're, you've got the, your own brand, Cora, which is yes. going from strength 
to strength. Yeah. And I hear a rumour that there's going to be some new launches coming out very shortly. Yes. Can't wait. Organics, yes. It's really exciting to, to yeah, see that. Yeah, it is. It's very exciting. I've really put my heart and soul into that brand and it's something that I'm very passionate about. Um, and it's wonderful to see the, the results that we're getting on a and how about books? You've, you penned a, a fantastic book, Treasure Yourself. Yes, sec I've got another book coming out. Oh, next with Hay time. House? Yes. Fantastic. Is it along the same lines as yes. Treasure Yourself? Because we received that many wonderful like, letters from young girls just saying that it's been a great inspiration. But old girls like it too. <laughs> I love it. I love you the do. affirmation section. Yeah, and Ellen really loved it as well when I was on High Ellen. praise, she, high praise, yeah. Yeah, it was really nice. So. So let me just ask you, you're, you're travelling the world all the time, you, you've got so many commitments, you are really the modern day um, super woman. <laughs> How do you bring balance and a sense of normalcy to your everyday life? Because, you know, you're a wife, you're a mother, I assume at some point you want to go again. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The thing is, what's really important and what I find really works is to take moments for yourself, even if it's just like doing a few deep deep belly breaths, just to kind of regroup and take those little moments for yourself so that then you can actually give more. Yes. Um, you know, I also really like doing yoga. I find after I've done a yoga practice, feel much, feel like I can give so much more to my family and to work and whatnot. And, or maybe, you know, for, for everyone. Do you say no a lot? Do you, do you find no that you have to is, say no? Saying no is a, is a wonderful thing to learn um, and it's something that I, you know, I'm getting better at, for sure. Saying but you no seem to important. do it in the most gracious way that no one ever seems to get offended. <laughs> Saying no is important, like, to, you know, as a woman, as we try to do as much as we can, but it is important to say no and really do what you believe in and what you want to do and make sure that you give enough time to yourself so then you can give more as well. I find one of the challenges for me and my readers is most of us are working mothers yeah. and um, you know something sometimes has to give so it's either the exercise routine or the relationship with the partner or the time you spend with your child. Um, do you find that you have to really think consciously yeah. about how you want to live? Yeah and that's what like a lot of my decisions well all of my decisions are based around okay is this good for the family is this and is that the first priority do yeah. you I say is this good for the family will this work in together as a family as a schedule and I'm really lucky with my job that I might have busy periods like I've just had a busy rush you know, six weeks but then I'm going to have you know six weeks off with my son so it's nice to be able to do that and it's wonderful that Orlando's been here with me and then I'll go and support him while he's working and you know it's it's nice that we can do that and do, you, do have you got plans for baby number two not yet not yet no but it's it's a very special thing you know and I feel very blessed to have such a wonderful healthy child and it's probably the best experience I've ever had it is a it's an incredible experience it's really rewarding and do you, I think it gives you a depth of character and, and yeah. probably an empathy for all sorts of different people, yeah. right? Yeah, a great perspective on life and teaches you um, a lot of patience and... Humility. And, and humility and, and so many wonderful things. You just can't imagine that your heart could expand so much. Now, let me ask you a couple of superficial things that oh. we've talked about. The, what are you wearing today? Because oh. everyone said it's just the most stunning dress. Yeah, I love it because it, it just feels nice to wear it. It's Erdem. Great brand. The print is nice and it's spring. Is it cotton? It's cotton. Yeah, it's easy to wear. And your shoes? What, what shoes Lamban. have you got? Ah, uh, Lamban shoes. Mm -hmm. And a very beautiful navy blue Chanel. Yes, handbag. Very nice. I've got an eyelash in my eye now. <laughs> yeah, those are the things. So thank you so much thank for you. your time. It's always a pleasure to see you, and Thanks I always you. learn so much from you. Oh, I good. always, that's I, nice. I always find that you have, you know, something really practical to share, and that's yeah, what the feedback always is. That you're oh, very, good. very generous with some practical sharing yeah. of how to juggle a very busy and wonderful life. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Let's see. <laughs>